Let's see. Get in the middle of a chain reaction. That's what it is. Reaction. I need to hold you right nearer to you. So you can set me free. Talking about love, love, love. Talking about love. We're talking about love, love, love. Talk about love. Get in the middle of a chain reaction. Uh, 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 reaction. Need to hold you right here in my heart. And you can set me free. I'm talking about love. Love, love, I talk about love. Mm. Hey, 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 good morning, good afternoon, good evening, Grand Rising family. Welcome to the Mental House with me, your host. You know what I did? A lot of y'all didn't like what I had to say about uh, Madonna the other day, huh? I don't give a darn. I meant every word she needs to sit down. And um, the epitome of class is her Detroit sister, 78, um, who did a concert. And she did back to back to back Motown hits. And that is uh, the great Diana Ross. And Diana told thousands of uh, fans gathered at the Pyramid stage to feel the power of love as she reeled off hit after hit at the Glansbury Festival on Sunday evening. She kicked off her set with, Oh, oh man, oh, yeah, there's a new me coming out, and I gotta live, ah. Won't again. I'm completely positive. All right. It said uh, her, she had a tea time legend slot at the final day at Glastonbury. The soul singer treated the crowd to a selection of classic hits, including Baby Love, You Can't Hurry Love, No, You Just Have to Wait. She said, Love, don't come easy. It's a game of give and take. Oh, wow. And what's the one I was just singing? Get in the middle of the chain reaction. Midnight action. Let me stop. Uh, anyway, a slideshow of photos were shown to the crowd from Diane Roth's long career in the build-up to appearance. I mean, every time I see Diane Ross, I cry because she looks like my mother. Um, and their smiles and that overbite is just exactly... Um, my mother in her youth. And um, so I have a real special place in my heart for Miss Ross. And um, I'm glad to see her uh, come out and do what she do best. Uh, defying earlier ominous forecast, the sun shone down on the packed crowd, armed with flags and vibrant festival wear. She reeled off song after song after song. And she said, during these last three years, I'm going to call it vacation. It gave me a chance to really think about the important things in life because I couldn't go on the road. Um, and so that album is called Thank You. Uh, so she got there and gave them what they wanted, a diva. And the Madonna, you need to sit back and know there's no way in the world you can um, uh, wear anything and, and feel any of Miss Ross' shoes. And so that's not the point here. The point is, she commands the stage in a very beautiful, classy way. And I wish that you, at 63 years old, um, would respect that and appreciate that. Because I think as we get older, 
the younger people want to see us gracefully grow older. They want to look up to us and see the style that they want to. They don't want to see us out there wilding out and trying to do the things that they will be doing at 17 and 18 years old. Okay. And so that's exactly what I meant when I said um, uh, um, Diana Ross is a class act. So with that being said, if you like what you hear, please like, subscribe, and share the video, share the channel, and I'm going to see you in the next video. I love you, Miss Ross. You still the boss. I was so right, so right. Thought I could turn emotions on and on. I was so sure, so sure. But love uh, taught me who was, who was the boss.